So hi, what's up? It's your boy Sports Wizard and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today we're going to be doing Zverev vs. Harris Cincinnati Open round of 32. So let's get right into it. So my prediction is Zverev and Trey score on 4 6 6 3 6 4 mode hard. So yes, I think Harris can actually get a set out of Zverev. He's been in great form, but again, Zverev's been probably in the best form of anyone. He just won the Olympic gold medal. So yeah, um, let's get into the analysis. So Zverev has a good forehand. He has a solid serve, but it's also not consistent. He has good ground strokes. He's not a great mover, but he can still reach balls. He's also a baseliner. Zverev went to the U.S. Open final, Australian Open semifinals, Ron Gross semifinals also, and he went to Wimbledon fourth round. He has 15 titles, and he's number five on the road. He won both the ATV finals and the Olympics. Rose Harris, he went to the Austin Open third round, Rowan Gross in Wimbledon, and he also opened second round. He has zero titles, he's number 49 in the road. He's aggressive, he has a good serve, he has a decent ground strokes, and his backhand is a stronger side. <coughs> and uh, the head to head is 1 0 Zverev, and on hard, it's also 1 0 Zverev. So in the first inning, that's where Harris, like, he takes control, he hits aces, he hits winners, you know, with his backhand mainly, and he tries to rally with Zverev. But Zverev, I mean, he'll still hit winners, but I think, it's a, I think his serve will be a bit of a problem. I think they hit a lot of double faults. So eventually, I think Harris will win the set. In the second set, too, I think Zverev, he hits more winners, and he fixes his serve to hit a lot of aces also. And yeah, this time, he's the one that makes Harris move around a lot. Whereas Harris, I mean, he still hits winners with his back end, and he still hits a couple of aces. But I think it's going to be tough for him to reach Zverev's box and move around that much. So I think eventually Zverev will win the second set. In the third set, too, I think that's, that's where Zverev, like, he still hits winners and aces, but he tries to rally with Harris a lot and tries to make him move around a lot. And again... Harris also hits winners and aces, but again, throughout the, like the last two sets, it's going to be tough for Harris to return with Zverev's balls, and even if he does Zverev, he's going to make it for a winner. So in the first set, I think, that's, I think in the first set, just for like a quick recap, in the first set, I think that's where Harris, you know, he, he hits winners, he hits aces, and he makes Zverev move around. And also Zverev, he still hits winners and aces, but he, he won't serve that well. But in the last two sets, I think that's where Zverev, he fixes his serve, he hits winners, he hits aces, and he makes Harris move around. Whereas in the last two sets, Harris, he'll still hit winners and aces, but it's going to be tough for him to move around and reach the balls. So that's the quick recap. And yeah, this is the prediction. Please make sure to like, subscribe, and turn on those notifications. Guys, I really appreciate it if you guys liked, subscribed, and turned on those notifications. And guys, if you guys uh, didn't watch my previous video, it was Mavra versus... Um, Mavra versus McDonald, so go check that out as well. And uh, later today, we'll also be doing um, Sipsipsis and Barty's matches prediction, so just stay tuned for that as well. So yeah, guys, I'll see you next time. Peace.